Please welcome Nick to the show. He says he may have misled his girlfriend. Nick, what is going on? Well, Jerry, basically, I'm the hot stud of my town. I've actually been with 139 women, Jerry. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, here's the part I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm prepared to believe you, but is there a list? I mean, how do you keep count? I... Yeah, I have a list. A list of sex capades, Jerry. Do these women know after they go out with you they're being recorded, you know? Yes. Of the 139, who was your favorite? The one I'm with now. Oh. See, so you're a romantic stud. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. Okay, so how long you been with this one? About three months, Jerry. Is she aware that you've been with all these other women? To a point, yes. Okay, and so why are you here? I'm here because basically I want to tell her I was born a woman. So you're really a studette. <laughs> uh, okay, now why don't you tell them? Because basically it's like this. I'm trapped in the wrong body, Jerry. I've, I have a male brain. I'd rather sit on the couch and watch football. And I'm getting a sex change. Oh, oh, okay. I'm a dude with a period, Jerry. I mean, come on. <laughs> Boy, you're gonna get the women now. Uh, well, okay, that's what you're gonna do, and I don't mean to make fun of that, good for you. So now, uh, you're here to, oh, so your girlfriend now, you've been with her for three months, but she doesn't know you're really She a... has no clue, Jerry. Why wouldn't you, well, what kind of sex have you had? We've had sex a couple times. Basically, it gets all hot and heavy. Uh, she gets hot and heavy, gets on the bed, and she wants the lights turned out. So I turn off the lights and her with a and keep, keep my clothes on. <laughs> You can't imagine how happy I am that I asked that question. <laughs> okay, so that, that, there you go. And so you're here now to tell her. Now, are you afraid you're gonna lose her now? Yes, I'm terrified that I'm gonna lose her. Well, why? I'm not saying the first second you meet someone, you quickly tell them what your gender is, because it is nobody's business. But if you're gonna start having any kind of intimacy with that person, they have a right to know what your gender is. Maybe that woman doesn't wanna be with a woman. <laughs> you know. So you've really been deceptive with her. Yes, but see, the thing was, I just thought she was gonna be number 140. I went out, let me tell you from the beginning, this is what happened. I went to the club and I ran into this girl that had never been to town. And I know all the girls from town because obviously I've slept with them. And she was new to town, so I went up and I introduced myself and we got to talking and then I took her out on the dance floor because I, I have a couple of dance moves. I can oh, let's out see like some. <laughs> Okay, so uh, there you go, and, uh, and so you met her, and then you started dancing with her, and she was right, you know, attracted. Yeah, and I mean, I got to know her. It wasn't just another one night stand, another list right. from my Right, that's book. when you should have said, hey, before this goes any further. I was scared to tell her. That's why I brought her here. Oh, this is a good place, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, good luck to you, because you do like her, right? Yeah, I'm in love well, with her. You're in love with her. And here is Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. Welcome to the show. Uh, how long have you guys been together? A few months. Well, 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 good. Oh, so you don't know why you're here. Do yeah. you love him? Yeah. I think I'm falling in love with him. Oh. Well, you really seem like a, you really seem like a lovely, sweet girl. I can see why you would like her. What, what do you want to tell her? Well, baby, you know I love you. You know I care about you with all Love my heart, but I haven't been completely honest with you. There's something I need to tell you. I was born a woman. Oh! 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 I 
I don't understand. <laughs> I have a vagina, I have breasts. I was born this way. But I am in the midst of getting a sex change because I'm born in the wrong body. We had sex. Yeah, the lights were off and it was I thought that was because of my body. You thought what was because of your body? That we had sex in the dark. Oh, I, I, oh, so you thought he wanted just to have sex with you in the dark because the, he's not attracted to you? Well, you got to lose that idea. You're very attractive. That's crazy. Yeah. But boy, did you lie to her. But you had no clue that, you know, a little bit of woman there. I'm still the same person that she fell in love with. You're not the same person. You pretended to be someone you're not. So but you're that's not someone that I am, Jerry. It's just I haven't. No, you didn't say, you didn't tell her that I am a woman who wants to become a man. That would have been honest. You just pretended to be a man, and, and, the, and that's fairly significant. I didn't plan to fall in love with her. I just planned for her to be just another And then I ended up falling in love with her. And I, she's my better half, Jerry. She makes me want to be a better person. I love her. She, she gets me. She knows who I am on the inside. Well, obviously, she didn't. Uh, <laughs> but look, I, I'm not trying to make up your mind for you. But if, if you think you can adjust to this, if, you, if, you know, if you're in, in love with him, her, um, soon to be him, I, I just, I don't know. Yeah. Like I said, I have a lot to think about. Sure. I don't know. She is so incredibly sweet. You know, you're not going to find someone so sweet because most women right now would be hauling off, either running off or beating you up. So we'll be back. <laughs> If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.